Hello friends, welcome to my channel Go Digit. Today the topic which I'm going to cover here is how to receive payment from your customer in Microsoft Dynamics Navision. So let's start. I will open up the Navision. This is Microsoft Dynamics Navision 2017. So I have already opened up the customer list here and I have already filtered the customer also as you can see this is my customer I click on edit this will open up the customer card this is my test customer and as I you can see the balance here which is $2070 because here in the customer ledger entry it is showing that one sale invoice is posted against this customer which is of amount 2070 dollars so the sales invoice has already been done now what we will do is we will receive payment against this particular invoice from this customer so in order to receive the payment what i'll do is I will open up the payment journal so go to the search area type payment journal click enter so it will open up the payment journal I have already made the payment uh, one entry in this journal well, what you will do is choose payment in the document type which suggests that we are making the payment document number you can enter any document number here in the account type you must choose customer because right now I'm making I right now I'm receiving the payment from the customer so I will choose account type as a customer here now the account number here it, you should enter the desired required customer number here yeah, this is my customer number here now in this amount field because we are receiving payment from the customer so in this case the customer should be credited so for the credit amount we need to enter here minus 3000 minus sign suggest that customer is credited here let me open up the currency code here now in the balance account type you must choose bank account because we are receiving payment in our bank and in the bank balance account number you must choose the required bank account that means in this case I will choose this here and now our transaction is already made but wait because we are making the payment against that particular sale invoice so we must use these two fields applies to document type and applies to document number in the applies to document type we should select invoice and in applies to document number when we click on this this will open up the customer ledger entry also customer ledger entry screen where it will show the open sale invoices against that particular customer here in our case only one invoice is open so it is showing only this particular invoice so we have to select this and click ok and that's it 
invoice number already available here so now what we will do is we will post this general it is asking me do you want to post a general lines yes see the general lines were successfully posted so through this we have received the payment against this customer from this customer against that particular invoice so in order to check this click on view see the balance is now minus 930 before prior to this entry the balance was 2070 which is in positive not in negative negative sign shows here that this 930 dollar is due from our side to the particular customer because the if I filter this out you can see we have made a sale invoice to this customer for 2070 but the customer has paid to us 3000 so we already received higher amount from the customer so that's why the remaining balance is in negative now if I click on this payment and select on applied entry it will show that this payment is applied against which invoice this is the reference of this invoice which is applied against this payment so in this case we have made we have received the payment from the customer so thanks guys thanks for watching this video if you like this video please subscribe to my channel go digit thank you so much thanks for your support